Hello everyone, welcome okay. to the channel. Welcome back to our channel. Welcome back. Let's catch up. This isn't Cancun. This is not Cancun. This is not Atlanta, Georgia. But let's rewind as we walk you all through where we're at now and where we think we're headed next in life, not location speaking. So we got back from Cancun. I did get my Chipotle and uh, we spent the day watching Vampire Diaries and we essentially kind of started to close things out as we were getting ready to leave America and head back to Ireland. So I got all of my makeup. I got all of my makeup. I can't wait to sh do a makeup video with you, for you. I'll, I can't wait to do that. And then we packed up, said byes to everybody from a really great fun summer in the States. And now we are officially back in Ireland. I just feel like I've just gotten over jet lag, so it must be nearly a week. The weather has been good, it's been sunny. I've been throwing the curtains open to see the sun shining in, which is always good. It's really good for Ireland. And it's September, so... It's really good for Ireland. Yeah, yeah that's really good. <laughs> the week has been adjusting to jet lag, enjoying the nice weather that we've been very fortunate to come into, and we also went to see Coldplay. Yeah, good. It was amazing. We got there super early and we were one of the first ones in. I got a really good location and Chris Martin gave me an arm shake. He touched me. One of these. He looked at me and I think I was the only one that got an arm shake in that stadium that night. So I'm taking that as a W and I'm feeling pretty good about it. <laughs> yeah, I show you guys something actually. I'm going to show you guys something. That's why he's saying that. Hold on. Because it was an arm shake, right? She's wearing a jumper. So his hand went like this and was on her jumper. And so now that jumper is not getting washed. I will never wash that jumper ever. Why would I ever do something like that? Look at the eye contact he gave me. Look at that. Like, that's him there, and that's me there. And look at that eye contact, guys. Let me see that. Do you that's, see that? That's totally. That's me, and that's him. And that's him. And she just, she's just said this. I just said, hi, Chris. Hi, Chris. And he went like that. <laughs> like, he knew me. And maybe we did know each other in another universe, in another life. I don't know. But it was an amazing concert. And, yeah, it was amazing. I'm so happy. We came back and happened to see it because we thought we'd have to sell the tickets. So really happy it all worked out and I was able to see this and have that moment and have this patient man with me who stood in the rain as we waited to enter, stood the whole time as we waited for them to come out and play and then stood afterwards as I tried to find someone who had a video of that arm shake moment and then also relive that moment with me all night after the concert and all day the next day yeah incredible human being i have next to me and i'm really wow. really thankful for that as well you know <laughs> shut up i will say standing in line for a concert isn't half as bad as i thought it was going to be oh. even in the ring even in the ring so now what comes next it seems to be the question everyone keeps asking everyone is wondering like what are you doing how long are you staying what's going on what are you going to be doing a burning question the burning question even i'm asking myself we are asking ourselves that <laughs> like this What's next? As for what's next, we're gonna be in Ireland for a while, at least for a year. We're gonna be here for a, like, we're gonna be here for a while and we're gonna navigate what feels right to us. As I've already come on here and talked to you all about, I love creating content, but I don't know if this is something I want to do full time. I'm so grateful and thankful for all the opportunities that come mm. with creating content and doing social media. I think I'm just trying to navigate, is that what I want to do? Because I just feel like I want to do something else as well or something more. I just feel like I'm being pulled to do that. And I think I'm trying to figure out what that is. I started applying to some like TEFL jobs where I could still kind of teach. I don't see myself ever being back in secondary school, but I'm like, maybe I'll do that to get me out the house 
because I need to be out of the house at least a few times a week and that'll be good for me while then working on other projects on the side while also still doing social media for fun. But in terms of career and what's coming next for me personally, I don't know. <laughs> but I trust that everything will be okay. I don't know if you want to speak about anything on your end. If you're just like, I'm figuring it out. I'm figuring it out. <laughs> I'm trying to tap back into my Photoshop stuff. Because it's been a while. My hands are rusty. So that's what I'm going to be doing. You're going to be leaning into art. Yeah, I'm going to be leaning back into my... Uh, artistic. My calling. Artistic roots. Yeah. That's artistic roots. So it's really just, yeah. Roots. Delving back rules. into it. Delving back into it. There's a lot going on. Yeah. And I guess we'll figure out every other piece of like everything else that we need to figure out with life as, as they come. We've been fortunate to get a few brand deals, you know, the past few weeks. So we're very thankful for that. And yeah, really, really amazing brands that we're so happy and thankful to be working with. And mm -hmm. some future ones as well that are already in the pipes. Is that what you say? So we're very pipeline. grateful. For pipeline. <laughs> we're very grateful for those as well. We'll kind of see how that continues to move as we navigate our individual journeys of like what sparks joy and what makes us happy and see what that looks like. I'm hosting a meetup in Dublin in like two weeks. So I'm really excited about that. I'm, it, we're going to be playing Fidel. I'm really Fidel. nervous Paddle. on like... There's been a lot of like thing. I've been nervous about even like hosting something because I'm like, oh no, what if like other people in Ireland are mad at me for hosting something? And then I don't know. I don't know, guys. I'm my worst critic enemy. You don't have social media. I just, I, yeah, I was starting to think people would be mad at me for organizing something. And then I was also in my head of like, well, maybe people don't want to do this. Maybe people don't want to come. And then I don't know. I put something out there. If there are other people who, kind of want to make friends around. I just thought it would be nice to get people together and it would be really cool to meet a whole bunch of new people, especially being back and just like, you know, moving through friendships and stuff. I think it would be really cool to make some more friends as well, um, but we'll see what happens with that too. Of course, we'll always have trips planned because do you not know who we are? So we already have trips planned for next month and the month after as we figure out what December is going to look like. Actually, I have a trip planned for December as well. So oh. we're going to be chilling out. I didn't even know that. It's we're New finding Year's. out at the same time. It's New Year's with the girls. Oh, oh not me though. Yeah, not you. Oh, okay. no, That's not why you. I don't know. That's why you don't know. You're not coming. It's me and the girls. Um, but for September, we're staying put. We're chilling. We're settling back in. And we'll probably bring you guys along for a weekend in Dublin and you can see how chill it all is. <laughs> yeah. Definitely more chill. Um, I love this shirt on me. It looks so cute. That's from the concert. It's from the concert. To March. This is my favorite shirt that they were selling. I actually thought it was really nice. So. Um, yeah, it's pretty cool. I like it. Thank you guys for 5k subscribers, by the way, and... Let's see how this hair goes as well, look at this. <laughs> starting to grow out a lot more. It looks like he has a mullet, he got his hair cut in the States, and then he wanted to keep his curls, and this is what's happening, as he's keeping his curls. It's coming out like a mullet, <laughs> um, which is okay. So, yeah. let's see what the top up, the touch up looks like whenever I get it done. Are you just going to continue growing it like that? Yeah, I think I might just get ah, it. okay. Get it touched up. So Exclusive. Just trim down, you know. Exclusive. Take the lens out, but keep it the same. Exclusive. So there you go. That's <laughs> something to look forward to. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for watching this. Thanks for being here. Thanks for 5K subscribers. We're so grateful for this space of humans. Thanks. See you guys. Bye. Bye.